Good evening. Good morning to those joining from the US and Canada. Good afternoon to our friends from Europe and the UK. Welcome to this time of peace and quiet with our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. The next 45 minutes will draw you into intimate communication with God, the giver of comfort and healing. There will be spaces of silence interspersed with chants that are very easy to sing along with. In these pandemic times, where so many of us are on the edge, the best we could think of is uniting with each other in prayer and silence that will rise up like incense to God who will heal our land.
our God and Savior and thank him for his long arm of patience and his mercy. Thank God for this time of peace, tranquility, where our spirit soared and came into your presence. All glory to you. Lord Jesus, I praise you and thank you for your great mercy for keeping us safe, me and my family, for protecting us and for all your blessings. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for the countless graces and blessings and protection you have given us during this pandemic. Protect our children who are far away and us who are all alone here, our neighbors and friends. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Bless our country and all our frontline workers. Thank you, Lord, for all those that have been healed by your hand. Thank you, Lord, for your protection. Thank you, Lord, that you are always giving us back your hope. Thank you, Lord, for protecting our families from this virus 
and even though summer was affected by it she healed very quickly and also the elderly person thank you thank you lord for your mercy thank you lord for the gift of life and for your salvation thank you lord for never leaving us side in these difficult times thank you lord for every breath that we take and that we can that we are able to breathe Father, we thank you for your constant presence in our lives. Thank you, Lord, for all the countries Lord. that have come forward to help us and to provide us with the needed oxygen and medical supplies. We thank you for your unchanging love. Even in the midst of difficulties and trials, you are never far away from us. Thank you, Lord. for all you're doing in our lives in spite of what's going around us Lord. you are with us you are our strength our shield our buckler our protector thank you thank lord thank you lord simple regular folk are going out of their way to help out with their friends colleagues and in whatever possible way to help those who are afflicted thank you jesus thank you lord for your abundant blessings you've showered on us all just please grant your healing touch and all those suffering know that you are with them always thank you jesus thank you lord as your word says you need not fear any dangers at night or sudden attacks during the day or the plague or pandemic that strike in the dark or the evil that kills at daylight a thousand may fall around you 10000 around you but you will not be harmed thank you lord for this word thank you lord for your promise and protection thank you jesus thank you lord for protecting us from corona virus Thank you, Lord, for protecting poor people and my family from coronavirus. Thank you, Lord, for the vaccine you sent our way to protect us. Thank you, Lord, for our frontline workers, doctors, nurses, paramedical forces who put their life at danger, put a shield around them, and comfort and console their families, give them the strength to know that you are with them. and you will protect their loved ones thank you jesus for the blessings that you have given us lord for being the one constant in these uncertain times thank you lord for giving us this opportunity to come together as a community during these isolating times thank you lord for all the blessings showered upon us during this pandemic
2 Corinthians chapter 1 verses 3 and 4 Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ the Father of compassion and the God of all comfort who comforts us in all our troubles so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God
we pray for comfort to those mourning the loss of loved ones. We pray for the calming presence of the Holy Spirit with those who are sick or dying alone. We pray for strength for doctors and health care professionals. We pray for patience as our hearts draw nearer to one another despite the physical distancing. We pray for wisdom to those in civic authorities and all our leaders. We pray for love, that we may be sensitive to the sufferings of many and be considerate and kind to all. We pray for fortitude for those struggling with jobs and in financial difficulties.
we pray for hope in our constant endeavor to help those in need. For faith for all, the young and the old, facing uncertain times. Father God, reconcile our families, our communities, and our hurting relationships. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God of compassion, enable us to turn to you at every moment. We often forget that you dwell in us and we look elsewhere for you. Thank you for your Holy Spirit that is active in us, opening up ways not just to endure these hard times, but in you to use them to build. You inspire us to comfort and draw closer to each other. Oh, oh, oh. 
Those who seek God shall 